I have wanted to get a projector ever since my last birthday when my friend brought over his expensive BenQ projector to our group camping, when we had a mini rave. A little while ago, I received a projector from Gearbest. I was a bit skeptical because it was an $80 projector, while my friend's projector was close to $1000, so my expectations were pretty low, but I wanted to see how it turns out anyway. And finally, it arrived. The claimed brightness is 3000 lumens and a little later you will see how it performs in low and medium light environments. The box does not have lumen rating on it for whatever reason, but the basic specs are here. The most important one is probably the resolution, which in this case is 800 by 480. This is the resolution that it projects in. As for the source video, I tested it up to full HD. Inside the box I found an HDMI cable, a power cable, a remote control, an old school sound cable, a weird looking mushroom and of course the projector itself with the lens cap on it. Imagine if it wasn't there. Wouldn't that be a doozy? The HDMI cable is about 3 feet or 1 meter long, which isn't a lot but long enough to reach the laptop. The power cable that I got was with the odd Chinese plug. The old school sound cable in case you want to use it with the really old sound system and the weird mushroom thing which is used as a ceiling mount and a remote control that runs off of two AAA batteries. The projector comes with two HDMI outputs and you can switch between the sources using the buttons on top of it or with the remote. The Chinese plug issue has been solved with the travel adapter that I have picked up during my trip to Hong Kong back in 2013. I didn't want to get any copyright issues with this video, so in order to test it, we're going to see my brilliant reenactment of some of my favorite movies. I did not hit her, it is not true, it is bullshit, I did not hit her, I did not. Oh, hi Mark. Why are you wearing that stupid bunny suit? Why are you wearing that stupid man suit? I'm going to steal a declaration of independence. When I was telling my co-workers about the projector, my boss asked me if it's possible to watch it laying down if he pointed at the ceiling, and I wondered the same thing since I haven't tried that. Turns out, you can. Another question was the size, how viable it is to have it in small apartments, because you won't always have an empty wall easily available. In our test, I had it about 140 cm or 55 inches away from the wall, and the size of the projection was equivalent to a 35 inch TV. The further it is, the larger it can get, with the bigger size before it starts losing focus being 150 inches. For that, it needs to be roughly 5 meters or 15 feet away. But the most important part about it is that you can use it to practice your handshake figures with it. Pedro. 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 Pedro.